Once again, we are back at Homer Striker Fields as the Kalamazoo Growlers take on the Traverse City Pit Spitters. As we were last game, media credential, but this time it actually says my name on it. Got my boy Robbie with me today. What's up? Hopefully catching the ball to the face instead of me, you know. <laughs> Game hasn't started yet, but the drinking has. Last time I was here, I tried the hot dog, but this time we're gonna try the brat. Let's see how it tastes. Yep. That's the brat. Very good beer brat too. Mm -hmm. Good flavors. Snappy. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give it a solid like seven, seven and a half. Yeah. I feel like it could have a little more flavor. It's but it's, flavor. it does what it does, you know. I give it a seven and a half as well. get some uh, contact. Every city's going to know it for one inning. We'll see how far it goes, but this is going down. Right, right. How's it? That one. So we are currently in the worst seats in the house. About $14 to get in the door here. You're right here. There we go. Gets none of them. <laughs> oh, damn. Get there. There we go. There we go. When we got here, it was rainy and cloudy. Now it's sunny and hot. I think you might have dressed incorrectly. Yeah. You mind if we bother you for a second? Just got a couple of questions for you. So, would you call yourself a diehard or a casual Growlers fan? Casual. Casual. Okay. So, with that being said, what is the best food here at the ballpark? A burger. A burger. Nice. I have yet to try that, so I'll have to check that out. And last question is, who is the GOAT baseball player? Mine is Brandon Inch for the Tigers, yeah. Got gotcha, you, well, we appreciate it. Thanks no, for your time. Yeah, no problem. Have a good time. In the third, it's still one to zero, which is probably good for us because based on how they're pitching and how we're hitting, it didn't really seem like we were going to be close in this one. So The Traverse City team is still throwing a no-hitter through three innings, so we need a hit. We need bad. a hit bad. That's a good point. No hitter so far. We can't have that happen. I don't no. care. We got to do something. Get somebody else. Yeah, this is gross. Just saying. We need to be better. Do better. My favorite sound effect that they have is they use the Kawhi laugh. No. <laughs> and then literally like something will happen, they'll be like, ha 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 ha. Oh damn. Sprint! Sprint! There's way more people in this section than last time. All gas, no brakes, baby. <laughs>
Go download the app SeatGeek and use my code JSweet at checkout and save. The pit spitters are currently five and one, and the growlers are currently two and four. So if we can pull this off, it would definitely be an upset, but it would also help us turn around our trajectory for the season. There it is. There it is. Good hit. There we go. Good work. There we go. There we go. There we go. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> One more. One more. Let's go. There we go. After four innings, we're up two to one now. That was a great inning for us offensively. Now we just got to go out, and keep them shut down. They really haven't had much outside of that run, so hopefully we can keep our pitching up and keep them locked down. Get there. So next up, we're gonna go to the Oberon Oasis, which is basically the same thing as the Miller Lite Bear Trap, just a different alcohol sponsoring it. So $40 tickets, all you can eat, all you can drink, and you get five beer or alcohol tabs, whatever you want. I will say it probably has the worst view of all the seats here, but with all the amenities you get, you're probably not gonna be paying too much attention to the game anyway. So our second most expensive seats of the day come in at $24 each. You get a seat to yourself, you get this cool little table in front of you as well, and you're a little bit closer to the concessions, but other than that, you don't really get too much more than you get at the general admission. And as you can see, the view is not bad. Keep holding them up. <laughs> He's got his baby. Damn. There we go. Beer number two, already halfway gone. Sixth inning. Here we go, baby. We are 
are here at the Kelsey Credit Union Suites. And as you can see behind me, it's a pretty solid spot. These are, I believe, $40 each, and they come with umbrellas, an awning. Basically, you're not gonna get hit with a baseball, so there's that. You get unlimited food, <laughs> unlimited drinks, and you get a beer tab as well, so it's kind of worth it in my opinion. Then this is the view, which honestly is probably the best of the house. Oh, right there. Nope. Damn. Would you call yourself a casual or a diehard growler fan? Um, casual, probably. Casual. Yeah. Valid. And with that being said, what is the best food at this ballpark? Ooh. Uh, that's a tough call. Mm. Those brownies were pretty brownies? good. Brownies? Gotcha. Yeah. And last question I have for you. What brought you to the Kelsey Credit Union Suites? Uh, just hanging out with my kids. They're lining up for that seventh inning run. Oh, but, nice. Uh, nice. Yeah, we're all here today. So. Awesome. Sweet. I love to hear it. Yeah. Thank you for your time. I appreciate yeah, no it. Problem. Have a good one. Everybody came in. And there we go. Yeah. Woo! Oh. Woo! There we go. Woo! Keep the bases loaded too. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yep. One in. That was a One in. With how this game started, I could have never saw the score of what it is right now. It's nine to one growlers. After the first three innings, I thought this would be a horrible game, but that was nine to one. Nine to one. Killing them. <laughs> he got. Okay, so does that count? Dang it! So right now, we are in the Home Plate Club, which I don't even think you can pay to reserve these. These are reserved for specific people, specific companies, specific things like that. So good luck trying to get in here. Here's the view. This is why it's called the Home Plate Club. Nothing going. <laughs> what a hoe. That's up and it's down. Nope. Three through the bat now. <laughs> it is nine to one, still going into the last inning. Hopefully, we'll hold on. I don't see us losing this game by any means. I mean, it's possible, but very improbable at this point. Whoever runs their scoreboard and their sound effects is a go. That's it. There we go. That'll do. Good win. Good win. Woo! Thank you all very much for coming out and enjoying your Sunday with us here at Home Restricted Field. Nine to one after a two game skid against the same team here at home. Definitely a big win for this group. Big dub today, 9-1, to one, against a team that we lost two in a row to the last two games. So definitely a huge win for us. Big loss for them, too, as they're 5-1 and one coming into the game. We were 2-4. and four. Hopefully this is a big morale booster for us. That'll do it for this one. Y'all know what to do. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you on the next one. Peace.